I really appreciate you joining us here on the new JustinMartinOutdoors.com. And in the Beyond the Shot segment of videos, I want to do more than just archery stuff and kind of give you the tech tips and advice on things beyond the shot, whether it's with a shotgun, a rifle, or a bow. Well, it's springtime. We're out turkey hunting every day. And a lot of people ask me about calling. They say, well, I'm not a very good caller, so the, the bird didn't come. Calling is probably the least important thing about turkey hunting. Woodsmanship and patience are far more important than pretty calling. I'm by no means a competition caller, but that still doesn't mean we can't get the job done. And uh, just knowing where to go, have the patience of sitting there and making the right calls at the right time. The best call, when you've got a bird within 100 yards, in my opinion, is nothing but scratching in the leaves. And instead of just scratch, 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 there's kind of a rhythm to how a hen does that. It's one, two, three, one, two, just like this. And what she's actually doing is she's one, two, three, changing legs, one, two. So it's kind of cool how you can mimic that right there with your hand. If the bird's where you can't see him or you don't think he can see you, but he's close enough that you know he can hear that, Man, I've had so many birds gobble at that, and that actually closes the deal a lot better than a pretty sounding yelp. They can probably hear you scratching the leaves up to 100 yards, probably. And that gives them a little confidence and makes them feel uh, comfortable that everything's okay. Those hens are over there feeding, so they'll come on in and approach your decoy, approach your setup. So try that next time you're out there, and hopefully that'll help you bag that big old gobbler.